Hi guys, uh, just back uh, for another few videos on the uh, passenger platform project for uh, Union Station. So, hope you enjoy them and let me know uh, if anybody has any questions or comments. So, thank you and enjoy the videos. Bye. Hi guys, just a uh, quick video just to show you the three pieces in place of the uh, cover for the passenger platforms at Union Station. Yes, the bridge, which is in the foreground or in the middle right here, needs to be weathered. Uh, I'll get to that here in the next couple of weeks. But anyway, uh, this structure is done. Here's the first, the middle section. And then over here, this is the uh, longer section, which I just finished yesterday. There's the camera car. Uh, with the 282 that uh, pushes it in the, in the next video. I'm gonna step down, pardon the shaking, walk over here, give you a front picture of the front, and you can see the uh, track numbers are uh, placed above the uh, platforms. And I wanted them big uh, because uh, I just wanted to be able to see them properly. So, but anyway, uh, I want to thank DJ's Trains for showing me some techniques for doing the roofs. Yes, I know I got a lot more roofs to do, but uh, I wanted to learn a little bit on um, by doing this passenger cover uh, roof line. So, but anyway, uh, we'll get on to the next couple of videos, which will show you the train running underneath. And uh, you'll notice that a lot of the platform support legs are up off the uh, ground, so uh, it's uh, a little uneven, but uh, we'll jokingly say that uh, the reason is, is because it's uh, a lightweight, transparent aluminum. So but anyway, on to the next videos.